right now we are getting a better picture on IUPUI's decision to split into two separate universities. Yeah, tonight at 5.30, our Gina Galeros tells us what this means for students and staff. Right now, hundreds of leaders on multiple task forces have been working to create more opportunities when it comes to this name and image change, but it's also meant several questions here on campus. One of the biggest ones was, why is this happening? How is this really going to change anything if Purdue and IU are both going to be here? Leaders researched other universities across the country. What we see is universities separately working together in a city. They believe separating IUPUI into IU Indianapolis and Purdue University in Indianapolis will make both universities more recognizable. Neither were getting the attention that they deserved from it because it was mashed together. IU and Bloomington will be very similar to IU in Indianapolis. Leaders say 88% of IUPUI graduates stay here. The goal is to grow and retain faculty for the university, jobs for the Hoosier State, and get more federal, state, and local funding. So we have the opportunity to really connect the sciences here and the tech science corridor with our companies in Indianapolis and really start to merge our academics and our industries together in a way that we've never done before. Ironing out the details now and thinking big for the future. 10 years or 15 years, like I want to come back to this campus and I want to see that, okay, the change that we worked on so many years ago has made it into an even bigger university than what it was so many years ago. And these changes will begin to roll out in the fall 2024. We're told current students will not be affected. Reporting on IUPUI's campus, Gina Galeros, 13 News.